Winds to Weather Plus forecast with meteorologist Mary Marshall. Good afternoon, everyone. Looks like Boston is still taking a beating from the nor'easter that passed across the area. We can see some heavier bands setting up across Boston and parts of uh, Bangor, Maine. Upstate New York also getting in on some of the snow, along with some light snow showers around New York. But they could get another little burst uh, before the system uh, is said and done. So they're still seeing the brunt of it. We are on the tail end of it as it continues to take its trek to the north and to the east. We still have a few clouds out there, but we're starting to see a little bit of sunshine peak in between those clouds. So further out west around Hager. Town and parts of Pennsylvania. Still some lingering snow showers there, but for the most part, we're just seeing a few clouds. 29 now in Parkville, 28 in Westminster, 32 degrees right at the freezing mark downtown Baltimore, and 33 degrees at the airport. Winds are coming in from the northwest up to 16 miles per hour in Parkton and 17 mile per hour winds in Edgewood, and that certainly makes it feel a lot colder. It feels as if it's 18 in Parkton, feeling like 18 in Westminster, feels like 21 downtown, and it feels like 27 degrees at the airport. For the rest of the day, expect a mix of sun and clouds with a moderate breeze, with high temperatures between 32 and 36 degrees. On average, or wind chills between 23 and 20. Although, as we've seen, some places it will feel a little bit cooler than that. So, we'll hold steady at 34 by 2 o'clock, 33 by 4 p.m., and near the freezing mark area wide by 6 o'clock in the evening under clear skies. But here's a look at the weather headlines. We are not done with the winter weather just yet. Low teens for temperatures tonight, a rain and snow chance Thursday, and then another rain and snow chance by Sunday. And we'll watch these systems to see if they will bring us all snow rather than a mix of rain and snow. So, by 6 30 in the afternoon, most of the skies have begun to clear. For us at this point. Tomorrow looks great. It's going to be cold, but there'll be a bit more sunshine, and Thursday is when that chance returns. It's not until Thursday evening into Thursday night that we do begin to notice that rain snow mix. Here's 6 30 in the evening. We can see it's all snow for Hagerstown, Carroll County, uh, at least through Westminster. And as you go further south, a mix of rain and snow, and then just rain to the south. We'll move it over to about the 10 p.m. hour, and it looks like parts of uh, Harford and Cecil counties will see all snow at some point. Could still see a mix around the city and point south. Could still see some rain mixing in. Let's talk about the systems that are heading our way uh, Thursday. This is Thursday once again. We'll have that system clipping to the north of us. And then over the weekend, we'll get a break from it Saturday. But once again, between Sunday and Monday, we'll look for that system out of the southwest. This one will turn into a nor'easter. And this is going to move in our direction. So later Sunday into early Monday, another chance for that rain and snow. We can see that setting up and then moving off to the north and the east. So we could get a little bit more uh, snow around here before it's all said and done. For tonight, Chilly, low temperatures between 16 and 20 degrees. Wind chills between 8 and 13 degrees. For tomorrow, high of 31. Sunshine there, 35 Thursday, 34 degrees Friday. Again, slight chances for rain and snow mixing in there. And then Sunday, Monday, another chance for snow with some rain.